Welcome back to Let's Play Grand Turismo 4 Part 104. Finneon World Sports Endurance is complete, so if we just go down here, bada boom. That's done and out of the way. And now, we are moving on to the European one make races. Starting it off at Audi, we gotta get a an Audi TT. And apparently you can use a touring car in it, so let me just go to new cars, scroll all the way over, and get myself a psych. You thought? We're just gonna get this. Get absolutely bamboozled. A lot of colors to choose from, but personally, should we go complete college sports team frat boy style with the bright orange? No, we're going yellow. Because it looks nice. No, not to reference some mean car. Chill out, kids. Because it looks nice. Anyways. Pretty sure this is four wheel drive. But I don't need to get the VCD controller for this game because. Oh, 1337 kilograms. I have to do it. The number was there and I had to do it. Even though I probably didn't need to. And, uh. I'm actually not gonna do anything else to it. So. Here we go, Audi TTs. I have the 3.2 Quattro. So, should be a little bit OP. Only three races, which is nice. Except not really nice for a $57,000 car, so... Yikes. Like always... <clears throat> gotta turn this crap off. Crap on, crap off. Snap on, snap off. Fap on, fap off. <clears throat> So, let's see how this goes. Judging my A spec points, I definitely didn't need to do that weight reduction. Would have been just fine without it. And hello, Chase Cam. I can finally use you again now that I'm not in a semi challenging enduro. The steering feels a lot more loose on this car. It's one of the neat things about using a wheel in this game. Like, some cars, the steering feels way different, like a Geneta G4, that's a big example. It's a lot, it feels a lot more boaty and loose. Gotta get used to driving a whole new car now. I could probably downshift, but meh. Racing just to pay off the car, well, barely. Yeah, this track. Oh, wow, that was a. <clears throat> wasn't expecting that. An elevation change, though. I really hope this track does return in GT7, but I also hope they don't ruin it like the rest of the tracks are ruining. These tracks are fun for a reason, they have good flow to it, and then they just add some dumb slow section to it that completely ruins the flow of it. Also, I am destroying everybody. Welcome to El Capitan, where the AI drive like Helen Keller. Yeah, somebody made a El Capitan mod on Assetto recently. I need to try it out. But I've barely touched Assetto since I bought it. I bought it in summer of last year. I haven't played it since summer of last year, and I have 5.5 .5 hours total on it, which is like nothing. And I'm pretty sure most of those hours are me screwing around with the settings because it's so weird how they have it laid out.
This is boring. I want my money back. Badonka donkas. GT4 without cheat, heart eye, emoji face thing. I did have content manager, but I didn't really like using it and I didn't feel like learning it, so I kind of just gave up. <clears throat> didn't you have to pay for that shit or something? You have to pay for something, like, mod-related. And I was like, nah, bruh. I play Assetto way too much for my own good. Well, that's me with GT4. <laughs> so I can feel you on that. I really dislike Infineon. Well, I really like. I really dislike Suzuka and uh, what's that other fucking dumb one? Monza. Suzuka and Monza are like the dumbest tracks in my opinion, but they keep bringing those back. And there we go. Especially Monza. I don't get the hype around Monza. It's just, it's so dumb. It's so so dumb. But it's praise like freaking Jesus himself. Anyways. ka -chow. You have to pay for the premium version of Content Manager. Most features are free. Any contributions are free. <laughs> uh, I didn't know it was like made by one guy, but... I just don't like having to pay monthly subscriptions for things that you shouldn't need to pay monthly subscriptions for. It's just monthly robbery, that's all it is. <clears throat> also, I just realized this is a three-race championship. That's odd. wonder how many of those are in this game, because I, I never really tackled the one-make races whenever I used to play it. Mons is simple and provides chaos. Well, it, to me, it's just straight chicane, straight slight turn chicane, repeat. <laughs> Nothing but cautions and whatever you call it. I don't really keep up with, like, actual motorsport, so I'm a poser. Yes, exposed. I just like driving. I like driving and I like cars. Not so much like keeping up with motorsports and F1 and NASCAR and IndyCar and etc. Like, I'll throw on, like, whenever Nurburgring or Lasarth, not Lasarth, well, technically yes, but Lama or Nurburgring 24 hour, whenever those come around, I'll, I'll watch them. And just chill, but I don't keep up with it religiously. Just so we're clear on, like, my knowledge with all this stuff. But Monza, as far as, like, driving it, no. It just doesn't amuse me. And Suzuka is just hell. I may be a masochist, but not that big. Also clipping that corner like I always do. Do I play a lot of PC games? I usually play the same things. I don't really try new stuff. But the other games I do play are... 
I play GT2, 3, and 4, but everybody knows that. I also frequently play, uh, like, modded Call of Duty clients, so like IW4X, which is modded MW2, uh, Plutonium, which is Black Ops 2, I play a lot of zombies on there, pretty fun. Black Ops 3 zombies, I don't play multiplayer Call of Duty anymore, that's just, that's just dumb, I only play zombies. I play a shitload of Minecraft. Minecraft, a good old OG. Uh, what else? I like Far Cry quite a bit. Uh, I'll fart around on Beam and G every now and then and like a... Whatchamacallit, automation. I haven't done it recently, but... Those are always there to cure my boredom, I guess you could say. <clears throat> Do I snipe on COD? How did you know? That was one of those quick scopers, XX quick scopes underscore XX, trying to make montages and shit. I didn't do just that though. I did like a uh, red gunning and just pub stomping in general. Like trying to go for Moabs or uh, nuclears, stuff like that. But most of the time I sniped. Just because it was so satisfying whenever you got a nice clip. You're a trick shotter? Nice. I tried to trick shot, but dude. I have no patience for that. Not at all. The only time I would trick shot is just like in public, not public, private lobbies. Like, uh, trying to do 1080s off Red Roof and Terminal or, uh, window shots on Standoff, etc. All the popular things. As far as like my go-to Call of Duties, they were mainly MW3, Black Ops 1. I played Black Ops 2 like a decent amount, but it wasn't my favorite. Uh, I really liked Ghost. And I think my favorite as far as sniping goes is Black Ops 3. I just love the movement in that game. And I got used to the sniping on it pretty quickly. And I hit all my best clips on Black Ops 3 as well, so that's a nice little bonus. Even though they were all safeguard, lol. Oh, and, and I played like a ton of COD World War 2, especially after they fixed the game. But I haven't touched multiplayer in a solid two years at this point, so. I raged quite a bit. And I was like, okay, I think it's time to retire. Starting to take this a little too seriously. Safeguard and demolition where everybody clowns on you for hitting clips, right? I hit my first quad collat on uh, Ground Wars Safeguard on Hunted. And I hit a unsplit kill chain ending with the five on on Safeguard Hunted as well. That track was just amazing for Safeguard. I had so much fun on BO3. But there we have it. By the way, I'm racing. I don't even know what I'm doing, really. Kind of forgot I'm doing a LP episode. So, 5,000 credits. Ka chow. And only three races in this championship, which is weird, but I'll take it. Yay.
And let's see what kind of prize car we get. I wonder what it could be. So, what's it gonna be? Oh! Unexpected, but I shall gladly take. Nice. Actually, now that I think about it, I could use that for something in the future. Uh, Audi, Audi, there you are. Look at that. Pog. I can't believe I just said that. Gross. Let me verify if I can actually use this in the event I want to. No! No! I call bullshit. Well, that's annoying. So with that, stay tuned for more GT4.